Hey guys, we've done the speed clear on the Tonberry trial. We've also done the um, uh, the budget run on the Tonberry trial. Now we're doing the Tonberry versus Tonberry trial. We're going to everyone's grudge elite version with Barrel, best tank Barrel, best Tonberry tank in the game. Um, so yeah, no one's better at being a Tonberry tank than him. So he's got some spirit and hit points. He's got 100 water, 100 earth, and 30 light resist. He's going to tank all the damage and not die because, you know, he's a Tonberry. Um, Nicole, wind weapon. So he's going to be slowing the boss. He's also going to break the boss. And he's doing um, some buffing. And yeah, that's it. Bart is going to be our passive provoke evasion tank. He's also going to do wind damage, and he'll be doing entrust. Um, Yoshikiri is going to be our, our healer, our buffer. He's also going to be dispelling the imperils and giving magic mitigation on turn one to barrel. And then Ibarra, we're not using my base form. Um, shift form is going to be just chaining and dealing damage. We're not using her LB, so that's not really important. But she's got 300 demon killer, and there we go. And we're taking a friendly borrower. critty has got a nice one built on Diablo's um, base form. He looks like he's geared for uh, Machine Killer, maybe, which is fine, you know, whatever. But the shift form has uh, some Force Mysterian equipped and some LB damage. It's not quite the build I'm looking for. It's um, it's more of an LB build, but still, 275 Demon, which is all I really care about. So, let's get in here and do some Tonberry on Tonberry Violence. Alright, so to start off, we're going to have Barrel um, Total Eclipse to cover. We're going to have uh, Bart go ahead and, and trust over to Yoshi, who is going to shift. Now, turn one is really painful, but Yoshi's got our back here. So we're going to use Yoshi to Champion's Mentality for 90% damage reduction on Barrel, and then Ninpu for some stats. Nicole is going to um, break the boss's magic with Sharp Kick. And barrier stance for a mitigation buff that also hits the boss with wind to sl wind to slow him down. Um, now we want to use single target damage because we don't want to kill the babies quite yet. So Critty is going to do debilitating allure and then some sinister storms. Mine is going to shift, and we're going to do let's see, weakening appeal. Then we're going to do I forget what the skill is called, supernatural frenzy. And then a, um, a Sinister Storm. Alright, so we're going to do this. And this shouldn't kill the babies. We're not, a we're not AoE chaining. Yep, we're good. Alright, so Barrel's going to take some big hits. But he's fine. He, he's a boss, you know. Barrel's got this. Not a problem. Alright, so we are in peril now. So Yoshikiri is going to take care of that for us with the dual cast. We're going to heal up Barrel. And then dispel. So we're going to let's see. Start this. Change target. Target dispel. The target barrel. Get rid of that in peril, and barrel will go ahead and recast cover. We're good. Now friend is going to spell binding. We're going to. Uh, oh, we're going to shift the friend. I'm sorry. And we're going to spell binding. We're going to have the friend do. Um, Supernatural Frenzy, and then, uh, let's see, Sinister Storm. And mine can just quad cast Sinister Storm. He already did the Supernatural Frenzy. And we're doing this on the main target. Um, yep, let's go ahead and do this. This will push a threshold, almost certainly. Oh, it actually didn't. Surprising. Okay, that's fine. It's not a problem, actually. Uh, okay, well, if we didn't push the threshold, then we can just do Heroic Stance here. Let's see. Bart will uh, hit the boss with the wind to slow him down. Okay. The babies are fine. Alright, let's go ahead and start. Um, let me see here. Let's do Sinister three times and uh, Ezioi. 
is a single target damage, yeah. So we're going to Sinister three times. And Easy Oi. Let's go ahead and do this. Threshold's been pushed. Two have been pushed. Alright. Let's go ahead and final doink. Oh, no, 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 no. Oop, whoops. I almost messed that up. No, we have to uh, cure the Imperil. No doinking today. Alright, Curega and Dispel. So we do this. We retarget Barrel to get rid of the Imperil. Um, and we have to cover again. Uh, let's see. Nicole doesn't have anything to do here, so he can just, you know, whatever. Same thing with Bart, nothing to do, so we'll just hit the boss with wind. Okay, there's the first the first dispel. Alright, so mine is going to do an and cuckoo. And then some sinister storms. We're not going to chain these. Uh, friend is going to Sinister Storm four times. Let's see here. Let's go ahead and do our damage first. Perfect. Uh, Yoshi needs to cure the Imperils, so we're going to dual cast. Let's go ahead and cure Rega and dispel. So we. Uh, whoop, nope, I don't want to do that. Let's do this. Change to barrel. Barrel, please be continue being best tank. Alright, we need um, holy resist now. So let's go ahead and holy resist for barrel. Nicole can... There's really nothing for Nicole to do. Like, his job was turn one, and now he's done. <laughs> okay, now it's time to finish off this fight. Turn 5 all missions. Ibarra, now it is time to add that AoE damage with Ankuku. We win! There it is! All missions, 5 turns, no deaths. Barrel, best tank, and Ibar. Um, and again, you can use Ibar to one shot the fight with uh, her LB, but that's no fun. We already we already did the one shot clear. The one shot clear was with Sora, so Ibar did it with chaining, and Barrel. Very fun, very exciting, and Bart's of course. You know, best tank as well. I look forward to Bart's new Visions Awakening coming later. But for now, that was a fun clear. See you guys next time.